think about knocking them boots off. Hotter than a 12 gauge pump when it shoots off. So I've never seen a country girl moving it like this. I think I'm How's it going, everybody? Flint from Flint and Steel Survival bringing you a update video and EDC all at the same time. Um, hopefully you guys enjoy. First off, the updates. So most of what you've seen on my content other than unboxings on my channel, sorry. The content on my channel has been pre-recorded from my trip all the way back in March. Um, I apologize if you guys feel fooled, but uh, I kind of took a little hiatus from YouTube. I had so much content, I didn't really want to film anything. Um, but a couple updates for you. I haven't been with a vehicle for two weeks. Um, my truck's transmission went out $3,397 later. Um, we got that sorted out, so that's bonus. And I also tore apart my entire man cave. I'm rearranging it, trying to make it flow a little bit better. Um, giving myself more room so I don't feel so cramped. That's huge for me. So right now I don't really have a video making cable. And I'm sorry if you can hear the uh, hockey game in the background. I am super excited about it being postseason hockey, so I turned it down a little bit. So enough boring you. Um, stay tuned. I will, I'll be making some stuff. I got a couple tag videos that I've been really delinquent on, so I apologize to those folk. Um, but yeah, we're gonna get moving on it, and I apologize again. So let's start. So first off, this is my firearm of the day. Um, I took this with me on some errands after work. I wasn't able to carry it work like usual. So we'll safety check this. It is going to be... Sorry guys, stupid camera decided it wanted to switch modes on me again. So you guys should be proud. I did have one in the chamber today as I walked around. Um, it's still been weird for me to have a round in the chamber in my carry pistol. Um, I'm not, just not used to it, so other than my revolvers, they always have a round ready to go. So my holster is the Galco, let me turn on this light, it's a little better. The Galco L169L STO424B, I don't know if that means anything to anybody. Inside the waistband, leather, it protects the trigger, it's really, really what it's for. Um, this has a safety on it as well. My new wallet, this is near the EDC, Fear, Fight the Dead, Fear the Living. Uh, it's a Walking Dead wallet, this is Daryl's Poncho. Picked this up for $4 at um, Spencer's Gifts, I don't know if those are a Utah thing or nationwide, but this was on sale, they also had some Mandalorian ones on sale, but this is the one I picked. It was nice and simple. It came with a chain and everything for four bucks. And this is my Leatherman Wingman. This is my multi-tool. I carry it everywhere all the time. Never let me down. Then I got my work badge. That's just the back of it. Throw that in there. My um, bandana. I couldn't think of what this is called for a minute. That's always with me. Then this is a new item you guys haven't seen yet. I made this. So what it is, it's my EDC comb from uh, DMK Custom Knives. This is the comb he made me, carbon fiber kydex handle. Um, folding comb. It slips right in this side. And then on the other side I have my Boker SHOT Show 2015 flashlight. Don't quite remember the model number on that guy. But I was sick of my flashlight spinning and going all the way to the bottom of my pocket. So I made this so that it can carry both of those upright. Then my blade of the day. I've been carrying this real steel the last couple days. I'm really liking it. It has my uh, cowboy skull bead on it. Absolutely love this guy. Razor blade sharp. Great action on it. So that's been the blade this week. Then I finally got my truck keys back. Such a good day. Um, I got Key Smart with my keys in it. I have my Doohickey. And then I also have the Snailer that I also got from that Instagram purchase where I purchased the real steel. That's my back pockets, both my main front pockets. 
I have a gum wrapper and 20 cents. Let's see. Okay, in my little fifth pocket, that pocket inside your right pocket, a sand disc, 32 gig flash drive for work. My flint and steel survival custom lighter. My 50 cent piece. We're getting towards the end, guys. Paint pen. This is a blue paint pen. I use it at work. Like I said, I came from work, immediately went back out. Carmex lip balm. Extra winter green, or spearmint, sorry. And that's all that's in my pockets. Then my jewelry for the day. I switched out my Demented Steelworks skull that I was wearing every day for a necklace version of that cowboy skull so my necklace matches my knife bead. I thought that was pretty cool. Then as always my wedding ring. That's an EDC. I only take it off when I'm running machines to where it could endanger my hands. Then I got my Suicide is Not an Option bracelet and probably the fifth flint and steel survival bracelet I've worn. I always wear the letters off because I wear that every day. And then I got a pair of polarized sunglasses. These ones are just, uh, I don't remember what the brand is, FS. And it's in the fishing section at Walmart. Those are great glasses. They fit really well. And then a hat. So thanks everybody for watching. I appreciate it. Um, bear with me. Like I said, I've got more content coming. And I've got a couple tag videos I really have to get out. So I appreciate everybody watching. Have a good one. Bye.